I've always used the term uh, all my career uh, mentalist because uh, I don't consider myself a psychic. I have no uh, special supernatural powers, what have you. But I've always felt it was possible, even when I started performing, and that was when I was about 12 years old, that it was possible under certain conditions to perceive a person's thought. We're seeing it happen less and less in recent years because our culture, as the traditional culture is disintegrating, and I've spoken before so many, many uh, professional groups and sociologists agree with me, people are not communicating anymore. They're relying on a box or a machine in their hand. And of course, we now find this, our, our level of education in this country has plummeted. And education is very important to me. I've done over a thousand university shows. But people don't hear each other anymore. They're actually human beings. And this is gonna seem incredible, who when they're in a restaurant have a cell phone on the table and are looking into it. And I don't, and I have nothing against cell phones and what have you because it's an important form of communication. But it's telling us unconsciously how we feel about the person across from us. We don't really value them that much because we're not paying that much attention to them. People talk to us just as much when they're not speaking. We need to listen to silence and not be afraid of silence. And there are people who reached a point where they are afraid of silence. I mean, when you go into their house, have a television on and a radio on. And you begin to realize that they really can't live unless there's something busy around them. I mean, God, if, you, if you're not taking your kid on hikes, you don't have to have money, but just on hikes into the forest and listen to Mother Nature because Mother Nature is talking. And sometimes when you listen to Mother Nature, you can hear voices. And it isn't really that they're speaking to you. It's your unconscious is turning things around and picking up certain sounds that remind you of something that's maybe in the back of your mind. Do I believe it's possible to perceive a thought? Yeah, under certain conditions, yes. Pro providing a person concentrates.